of the squad. Start us off, Graeme. We'll go around the panel. Give us a name. Who's going to win the title? If you put, as we sit today, Man City. Geiska. I go Man City. Charlie? Man City. Man City. I'm going to go with Chelsea. But I don't think we, I, you know, I do honestly think it's ridiculous to say now because so much is going to change. Yeah. There's going to be a huge domino effect when Bale yeah. goes to. When no, all eyes on the screens. Ah, the comedy one first. <laughs> <laughs> Go on. Seriously? Well, Tottenham no. are not going to finish eighth, that's for sure. Well, this is based on now knowing that there's a chance that Bale might <laughs> go or Tottenham. not. Depending. What? This was two days ago. I mean, my big, biggest question there would be Newcastle out of the hole. That, that would. I, and Liverpool I'd fourth. struggle to I'd, see them finishing seventh. I could do what you lot have done and just. You know, if it was that predictable... And Everton 16th, be... <laughs> they can't have that. You can't go from 6th to 16th in one, in one year. Yeah, well, you can't go eight, eight, what was it, 11 points clear at the top of the league and finish 3rd, apparently. <laughs> yeah, we'll see who's laughing. <laughs> we will see who's laughing. Surely mine's going to look good against that last one. Right, that so you, good, this yeah. is interesting though, that you've both gone for Chelsea to be champions. So I'm assuming that Chelsea are going to buy a striker. If they don't, then I'm going to flip the first and second. Um, but I'm assuming Chelsea are buy a striker. What, yeah. you think Man United can win the league? If Ch <laughs> Seriously? <laughs> yeah. Oh, right, fair enough. Okay, let's have a look at the bottom. Who do you think is going to... You are banned from BT Sport for the rest of all time. Isn't <laughs> they, it? Why, they why both are. Why not? Would Norwich be finishing in 18th place? Oh, um, and you think Stoke 11th? So doing better than last year yeah, without I think you, I've, then? I've got, yeah, better. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I didn't have much influence last year. No, I think they've got some better players than, than they get credit for. I think they could have a decent season. OK, let's have a look who's up next. Owen, also gone for Chelsea as champions. What do you think of that one, Nacho? Good table? Yeah, yeah, I, yeah well, I, I've gone against Owen, but um, that top seven, I think, looks... Looks as if we've all gone. Well, for it. Everton, Everton, Southampton in ninth, top seven. I, I like Southampton. I yeah. think they're great. They got good players. They got a great manager. They're aggressive. They, they press. The only one I, I'm slightly worried about is Newcastle. If they can get it together, they'd be there. If not, they could be. And all the signings at Spurs, and you still see Arsenal fall. Yeah, they're, they're going to sign players, and they're going to be good. They're, they're getting the Champions League. Tottenham's there about. They always played great, even last season, and they still didn't get there. Yeah. Okay, and let's see who thinks going down. Sunderland along with the two promoted clubs. I'm worried about Sunderland. I just think they're lacking a little bit in quality and I think they've got they've got some players but I think they need more and I think with the change of manager I think, I, I'm, I'm worried about them, honestly. Okay, and let's have a look at Macca's table. Who to see what Manama thinks is going to win the league? Look Manchester that, City. Hey, look at that picture of me though. I look about 55. <laughs> <laughs> Shocking. <laughs> yeah, I've gone for Manchester City, but we've picked now and Manchester City have invested heavily, so that's why I've gone for them as, um, as, as champions. I put Liverpool in, I put Arsenal and Tottenham, I think they'll do well. I've got the same seven as the rest of the... Well, the rest listen of the, to everyone here debating what the they're seeing the on the league table. Say so Liverpool fourth. The rest of the normal lads, I've got seven in. I've got the top seven. Why Liverpool same. fourth? I agree with that. Fourth. Because I just think that yeah, they'll improve on, that, on last year, and I think... I think they've done decent business, and I'm, I've got Palace Hall and I've got Stoke in the um, in the. There was a caveat. In though. the bottom three, I saw them play a lot of the time at the end of last year, and I'm not impressed with Mark Hughes' signings. That's why, I mean, it's not, it's, it's good to hear Michael talk yeah. highly of them, and I'm, I'm, that's why I said I'm interested to speak to Tony Pulis about them. But I think okay. we're, um, we're, pr we're pretty constant on the top seven and certainly the bottom two. All right, well, there we go. Those are the predictions from the men that you'll be watching football with this year. And this is the opening will be. United third favourites, uh, astonishingly, really. But uh, Mourinho comes out with Chelsea tomorrow, City on, uh, <laughs> on Monday. How do, you, how do you see it? Personally, I think between Man U and Man City. Yeah. I'm not sure Chelsea defensively. On this show, you have to go for one. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to go Man City. Chelsea for me at this moment in time, but in two weeks' time, that could right. change.